We had the cold kombus and there's the ARM Cortex A72 octa core uh, tablet. This is the this is the box uh, tablet. It's an 8 inch, 2048 by 1536 display resolution tablet. Uh, it has a Qualcomm 652 processor with the octa core A72s and A53s, and uh, it has CAT6 uh, carrier aggregation 2 times 20. So this particular tablet, which essentially has the same hardware specs you could say as an iPad mini, but connected with CAT6 LTE, uh, and it's built by Box, which is a white label ODM, and it's available for any carrier or national retailer to pick it up as a store brand tablet that can be retailed for essentially half the price of a LTE based uh, iPad mini. So we're talking about half the price, but this is uh, ARM Cortex A72 octa core. Absolutely. Uh, it's the it's best in class, highest performing uh, processor core from ARM that's currently available. Do, uh, it's the A72. This is, this is awesome. And we hear the mobile compute area. So, so who are you? What do you do? Uh, I'm Seishu Mathopedi. I'm the Vice President of Product Management uh, in Qualcomm. I'm responsible for the mobile computing product line in, uh, in Qualcomm. And uh, we have uh, several products and technologies that we are highlighting here. Uh, as I said, you know, we have a huge uh, white label ecosystem that we support in the tablet space in addition to supporting branded OEMs. And this one's a white label tablet from Books. Uh, what we do is we infuse Snapdragon uh, products, the uh, chipsets, with uh, key technologies that enable differentiated uh, tablet experiences. And one of them is immersive audio. Here's the Box tablet where we're able to show you immersive audio. Obviously, in a tablet, because it has a larger uh, form factor, you can have stereo speakers that are a little bit wide apart. Yeah. So high fidelity stereo sound you can play using the 652 processor. It's built into the processor. But in addition, we also have value-added immersive audio capability. And let me play, uh, play this for you. Uh, you'll see that uh, uh, when we play uh, a, a, a sound clip, uh, you can, and this is high fidelity uh, studio audio. Yeah. However, um, if you enable immersive audio, then it takes the sound to the next level, and I'm going to enable it that now. So what happens when you do that is it creates a surround sound effect. Even though you don't have 5.1 speakers, it feels like it do, because the studio speakers with this immersive audio capability emulates or simulates the experience of surround sound. So we're talking so, about 3D audio kind of? You, yeah, absolutely. You, when you watch it, you will experience 3D audio, you will experience sounds coming from behind you, even though there's only two speakers on the, t on the, on nice. the tablet. And this it's, is implemented on, on the SOC? It's implemented on Snapdragon and it is Qualcomm technology. So right. these are the types of differentiated experiences we're able to uh, offer over and above what is typically available yes. on, a, on a tablet. And here's another experience that we have, it's called Adaptive Display. And this is essentially the capability where uh, your tablet, if you're watching a movie, uh, the, the experience of the video that you see is adapted to the ambient light. So right. here's, here you're watching and the, the light here is not that yeah. great, so, but you can still see the video very well. Now let's say you move into sunlight and I'm simulating sunlight by putting a flash here. When you do that, you can see that actually the contrast and the lighting on a per pixel level is completely changed so that you can actually see the uh, video even in bright light. Oh, nice. And uh, if I take away the light, you can see that there's a very big difference in terms of, uh, in terms of what, uh, what it looks like. And when I put the light, you can see that it becomes brighter. Cool. So this but it's not making brighter by changing the display setting. It's making it brighter by enhancing the actual uh, brightness of each pixel so that the contrast is higher. So when I remove it, you see, in ambient light you can see it. When I put it, yeah. it becomes much brighter. Nice. So all this is implemented on the 652. Uh... 652. So we have many technologies that improve the audio capability and the video capability on tablets that are built by Snapdragon. And that's what we call the tablet home theater on the go experience because more and more people are consuming uh, video content, movies, TV content on their tablets when they're away from home. And this uh, ARM Cortex A72, the 652, is shipping since the beginning of the year, right? Uh, since, uh, so fourth, it's mass production is ready? In fact, fourth quarter of uh, 2015. It's right. been shipping for about five months now. All right. And uh, the end devices are also available. Absolutely. And it's, uh, 652, as the name suggests, is our mid-range processor. So what we're able to do is actually at a mid-range 
uh, level bring premium experiences and performance uh, to the consumer. So you're doing A72 octa-core big little uh, as a mid-range? Absolutely. Because our, our top range, the processor is 820, and that's based on uh, Qualcomm's own Cryo 64-bit processor, which is much higher performance than the A72. All right. But this is a, this is a, um, also a low low power consumption. Is a that's strong right. battery. Yeah. Absolutely. So we have extremely sophisticated power management capability on Snapdragon that allows you to be able to offer 30 to 40% higher performance from a battery perspective.